hey what's up guys and welcome back to another tweaks video in today's video let me share with you guys what kind of tweaks that i run on my jello broken device this is some uh, cool and nice tweaks that i want to share with you guys of course most of the tweaks that i'm about to show you guys it works on ios 12 up to 13.3.1 if you use the check range jello break if you already using the uncover this will be work for you as well so i'm about to show you guys some free tweaks and some of the tweaks i will be telling you if it's already you have to purchase for those tweaks anyway if you want to see and you want to learn how you jailbreak your device first of all if you want the uh, check crane method with windows it is available i will be put the link for you guys in the description also one of the cards will be here in the screen and if you want to know how you jailbreak with uncover also i will be put one of the cards will be here and also in the description down below anyway guys before i'm gonna be start today's video let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up also make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever i release a cta tweaks video let me first of all talking about the AOD. This is one of the cool tweaks that you have to purchase in order to download this one. This one will be specific for your lock screen. This is also make you to customize different kind of things, a lot of things for your notification. The tweak will be for your lock screen, for your uh, the notification for most of the stuff for the clock you can customize different kind of stuff let me show you guys if i want to plug my device in the charge will be bring some nice effect and also if you want to see the way of how you receive your notification on the lock screen this is how it's going to be looks like so i told you guys about this one you have to purchase for this one in order to download that tweak so the name for this one will be the aod Moving right now to talking about the other one on my lock screen, which is I use the Exxon. This is for your notification in group, ungroup, the notification that you receive already. So if you tap on the icon, this will be bring all the icons here and you can ungroup and read most of the notification. But basically, once you download the tweak, the tweak become in your lock screen as an icon. So just tap on the icon and this is the way about the Exxon. One of the beautiful tweaks that I already have on my lock screen, which will be the dots to here. So this is will be bring a dots into your lock screen. So you can take a look at the dots at the top here. And then even if your device, if you wake up your device, if you lock your device, the dots will be at the top, just under the notch here. And this is will be notify you that you already receive a notification. This is the once again called the dots two and in speaking about another cd tweak that i run on my lock screen and of course you need to download the maple 2 this is will be bring a nice effect if you want to plug your device in a charge you might see right now here if i want to plug my device in a charge you can see the effect that comes with that week once you install it and as i told you guys this is will be specific for your lock screen to bring that kind of beautiful animation once you want to plug your device in a charge anyway this one will be called the maple 2 another cd tweet that i run already on my lock screen so you guys might take a look that i have cedia here and the safari browser instead of the flashlight and the camera icon so you can set those using another cd tweet this one will be called the quick lock screen or the quick ls so you can uh, put any kind of application that you want right away to launch right away from your lock screen so this is what i do and this one will be called the quick ls anyway let me go ahead right now and launch my control center or my cc you can take a look the way i like to keep my control center or the cc just simple as that simple enough this is how is it i like it always so the first one that i use in order to make the icons or the manuals whenever you want to call it just like that or this is the style this is the cool cc and the other one which is for me really important so i bring the power manual so you can resupring going to the save mode something like that once you stuck in something or you want to resupring your device and this is the way how i keep always my cc let's move right now to talking about my springboard or my home screen the first one that i like if i want to launch the home plus 
you will be organized you can put your uh, layout of your icon in your eye device the way you like so you can take a look that is different kind of stuff here at the side so you can mess around with that you can use most of the things in the top and the bottom you can organize your device or the layout for your icon the way you like swipe just like that swipe up and you can cancel everything you can toggle everything the way you like and this is the way how is the home plus working just like that and the other cda tweak that i already used before and is still working on it in order to organize all the icons that i have on my i device of course the epoxy 4 this is really amazing tweak so you can adjust the way of your icon just like that this is another one that i really like to have always once I jailbreak any one of the devices that I have just like that once again this one will be called epoxy 4 another CD tweet that I want to show in you guys the dots here under the notch here and this is another CD tweak which will be provide you always with those dots that's mean you have still notification you didn't read it just like the way to notify you always this one will be called the plots so the uh, as I told you guys the dots will be show up always here in your springboard and also if you go to the lock screen will be the same method just like that so anyway this one will be called the plots another C that week which is I really like the bottom toolbar this is will be shortcut for most the uh, modules that you have specific one that you already pick from under the settings so you can pick your player for example some of the uh, shortcuts here some of the icons that you recently uh, use always and one of the uh, icons that you already use for example your wi-fi your airplane mode your bluetooth and so on as i told you guys this is a really cool one to bring most of the stuff that you use always you don't need to go under the settings or launch your cc and toggle some of the things you can bring that with that week and once again this one will be called the bottom tool bar and of course always once you jailbreak your device you need to have some of the nice effect once you want to switch between the uh, pages here and of course i use the cylinder here which is give my device really nice and beautiful looking once i swipe between the pages this is the cylinder one of the nice and cool tweak that I already download, it's for my keyboard. So to keep your keyboard always nice and shiny, using the dark mode, you can go ahead and download the dark keys. So if I tap here to bring my keyboard, you can take a look at shiny, nice and clear. And this is the way how I always keep my keyboard just like that and this is once you download the tweak that tweak will be present the keyboard will be work in each single application or icon you have in your jello broken device once again this one will be called the dark keys you might take a look right now here that i'm running another cd tweak the edge edge is always giving you that nice looking around all the corners and also once you download the tweak that tweak will be came with different kind of options so you can configure those options and this is the way how is the tweak will be prevent you with that edge once again this one will be called edge another cd tweak that i'm running on my springboard if you guys can take a look just focus here that is some effect right behind the settings here and other icons that has notification so the name for that week will be the firefly you can take a look that is multiple colors always show up right behind the uh, uh, the icon has any kind of notification on it you can take a look i put two different kind of colors so whenever you have any kind of notification uh, that icon will be glowing just like that to a different kind of color one color and then also that is if you want to go and customize the way of the tweak it will provide you with more than that colors anyway this one will be called the firefly always once i jailbreak my device it's not going to be complete if i don't download one of the cool tweak that i like for my DAC here so i already download the floating DAC plus this is will be bring the ipad DAC style 
and I like it that way. So if you guys are looking to bring the same thing, bring most of the icons, you can set it the way you like from under the settings. This one will be called the uh, Floating Dock Plus. If I want to organize the way of my settings and keeps all the tweaks at the top always, I use the shovel. So if I tap on the tweaks here, will be bring every single tweak that I have or running on my jello broken device. And also I can see every single thing in just one single top and always I keep it at the top just like that. If you want to do the same thing, you can go ahead and download the shovel. One of the cool tweaks that I already keep on my iDevice right now is the repo finder. So if you want to jailbreak, of course, always will be looking for different kind of sources in order to download the tweaks that you're looking for. So if you want to uh, download this one, this one will be came just like an icon. It's like an application. Go ahead and just launch that. This is will be work for Cydia, Celio, Zebra, and Installer. So if you tap on one of them, you can install that right away where you have or which installer you use. For me, for example, I use Cydia. So if you're looking to download one of them, just go ahead and tap on it. This will be take you right away into Safari browser and it will be told you if you want to set up that source inside, for example, Cydia, Celio, Zebra, or an installer. This is how the tweak will be work and I like it so much. Once again, this one will be called the repo finder. Once again, if I want to go back and talking about what I have with the keyboard, of course, I use the bar emoji. This is will be make you to bring any kind of favorite emoji that you always use. So with that keyboard, with the shiny keyboard that I use, I always keep all the emojis that I use always on my bottom of the keyboard. And this one will be called the bar emojis. Another cool tweak that I use on my jailbroken device is the health. Health will be bring that kind of beautiful uh, charging indicator or the percentage inside of it for my battery here. So you can take a look at it. If you put your device in safe mode, all the battery will be giving you the uh, yellow color. If you want to plug your device with a charge, will be green. The whole thing will be green and so on, just like that. So once again, this one will be called the health if i want to talking about my theming engine always i keep using the snowboard here so if i want to download one of the uh, theme that i want so this is what i use the snowboard if you guys asking about what kind of theme that i use this is the name for the theme that i use which is the blue bell also the source will be in the description and the name for the theme will be in the description if you guys are looking to get the same widget that I use right now on my Supreme Board, also the name will be in the description down below with the source if you guys are looking to download the same one. If you want to bring some effect into your Jello Broken device, some people they like that kind of effect. If you want to bring the same effect into your Jello Broken device, this is really nice and a beautiful widget. You can bring that. Of course, you need to download first of all the excellent HTML in order to place any kind of widget in your Supreme Board or your lock screen, just like that. So the name for this one, if you guys want to bring the same effect, this will be called the Float Widget. So the name will be in the description. If you guys want to bring the same kind of widget into your jailbroken device, just like that. But keep in mind, this will be drain your battery. Anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I hope you guys enjoy most of the tweaks that I already share with you guys. Once again, if you guys like today's video, make sure to give the video a big thumbs up. Also, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a CD tweaks video. Catch you in the next one. Peace out.